Alright. What's good, YouTube? Go Grinchy in the building! In the building! Alright, man. Alright, man. It's finally nice to... It's finally nice to be here. You know what I'm saying? I haven't... I haven't just sat down and just spoke in a while. You know what I'm saying? Mostly because... Mostly because... I've been distracted. I've been distracted, you know? We've we've all been distracted. We're always distracted. I feel like... Man! Nigga calling me. Oh, shit. I'm still recording. All right, man. So as I was saying, it's it's been it's been a while, and I've been distracted through social media. You know, I be going on there to like post some shit. Maybe I'll be posting some shit, and then I just end up scrolling for like two hours, and it's crazy, bro. Like the choke code, even as a content creator, like the choke code that social media has on the world is is insane to me, because it's like there's no escaping it. There's literally no escaping it. It's ac it's accessible to everyone on this earth. Even if you don't got a phone, you could you go to the library. Even if you don't, you know what I'm saying? Even if you don't got a phone, you go to the library. You know you like there's pub, you know what I'm saying? You cannot escape the the world of the internet. It's impossible. And it really just fucked me over in the sense of like I couldn't I couldn't tap into myself. Like I lost the vision of myself. I lost who I was. I got so caught up in just scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. I lost I lost the sense of purpose. Like, you know what I'm saying? Of course I never gave up on the YouTube. I, I will never give up on this. I will never give up on the music. Like those are two things that I cannot give up on. But in the process of me building this empire. That I started from ground zero. I built this shit from ground zero. You see me at what? 138 subs right now? I built this shit from ground zero, bro. Trust me. Trust me. That number will double by the end of the year, bro. But in the process of me building this empire, this kingdom, this community, I lost myself so many goddamn times. And even like, what I stand for and what I promote, what I push out to the world, like, it's, it's literally my life, you know what I'm saying? So when you lose, when you lose sight of that, when you lose sight of, like, bettering yourself, like, the workout videos, the vlogs, and all that shit, it starts to, it starts to, it starts to make you feel, like, ashamed, because it's like, you're promoting this, but when the cameras are off, you go back to this lazy ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? It fucks with you. It fucks with you. It's the same way how J. Cole was in that little rap beef with Drake and Kendrick. And the media was pushing this agenda like, you gotta clap back, you gotta clap back. And it's like, it's contradicting everything he stands for. You know what I'm saying? I don't like that contradiction. I, I fucking hate it because I, I feel like I feel like a piece of shit like I, I keep it I keep it a buck I feel like a piece of shit bro and that's what I don't need that's what I don't need but this year so far 2024 has just been a roller coaster a roller coaster ride man I did not expect a lot of shit to happen you know what I'm saying I lost a lot of friends I lost a lot of niggas that I thought that I thought was really, you know what I'm saying? That I thought was really locked in. And it kind of it kind of like made me realize like kind of made me feel used in a sense, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, it's just a way of life, you know what I'm saying? I can't go back in time. I can't go back in time. I, I and I definitely won't force anyone's hand. Cuz I know like when it comes down to me, fam, when it comes down to me, I'm going to take accountability of everything. Everything. I chose, I chose to be your friend. I chose to, I chose to help you out. I chose to come here. I chose to, you know what I'm saying? So when it comes to me, I take full, 
So when it comes to me, I take full accountability of that. And even though, even though you did me wrong, even though you fucked me over, you can't do it like me. You can't run this shit like me. You don't know how to operate it like me. Because we're two different niggas. We two different people. We operate in different realms. We think differently. You know what I'm saying? Your shit not going to be like my shit. And I'm I'm completely fine with that. I'm completely fine with that. It's okay. Some things I just meant to let go. Let it be, my nigga. I ain't going to trip. I ain't going to trip. I'm going to keep doing my shit, bro. Because I know my shit going to be better than yours. <laughs> That's just how it is, my nigga. I don't even got to look at no one else. I just got to look at me, bro. That's the only way to succeed. Like, I don't got to look at no one else. I just got to look at me. Like, what am I doing? Nigga, what am I doing to to go to that next level? What am I doing to reach that next step? You know what I'm saying? It's like, another thing that really fucked me over was like, the sleep. My fucking sleep, bro. I would always think I got to work 24-7 like a machine. I got to do this. Got to do that. This, that, that, that. And I'm working myself like a machine, like. And I, and I never realized that my attention, my attention is so valuable. You know what I'm saying? My attention is so valuable. My knowledge is so valuable. Why should I give it to you? I never put a price on it because I was trying to be a real nigga. I was trying to be a real nigga. But it seems like, it seems like motherfuckers see that and they try to abuse it. They try to use it against you. And that's where it's kind of like, what is, what, what is you doing, my nigga? That's when niggas see that and they try to use it against you, like, that willingness. You know what I'm saying? I was trying to be a stand-up nigga, for real. And it made me question, like, what do you get? What do you get out of helping? What do you get out of helping these niggas, bro? What do you get? I don't get shit, bro. I don't get shit, bro. I don't expect shit, bro. I don't expect nothing from niggas, bro. I'll keep it real with you. I don't expect nothing from niggas, bro. But it's like... I ain't need to help you. I ain't need to help you either. But it's like... When the tables turn and I come to you... You ain't trying to hear all that. When the tables turn and I'm I'm asking you for some help... You ain't trying to hear all that. You trying to switch up on a nigga. And that's what I don't like. That's what I don't like. I, I ain't counting no favors, but if we look at the statistics, my nigga, come on. Really, nigga? It's cool, though. Fam, every every situation I'm in, bro, I always say I'm finna thug this shit out, bro. I'm finna thug this shit out, bro. And look where I am. I'm back making videos, my nigga. I'ma drop today. I'ma drop. I might not drop tomorrow. I ain't gonna cat, but we gonna see. We gonna see. Time. Time is on our hands. Time is on our hands. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to make no promises to you guys I can't keep. Because if I do, then my my mind will constantly remind me like, damn, you told these niggas this and you ain't even do that shit. Damn, I finesse these niggas. Nah, bro, I can't do that. That's fake as fuck. I always told myself everything lies on me, bro. Because at the end of the day, when everyone's gone, it's just you. It's just you, bro. And another thing, I don't, I don't like comparing myself to people. Being around people made me realize that I don't, I don't really fuck with people like that. Being, being alone, no, 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 no. Being alone made me realize that I don't really fuck with people like that. Being alone made me realize that I don't, I don't even fuck with niggas like that, bro. And it's not me trying to cut niggas off. It's not me trying to, like, push away from them. But I just want to be on my solo shit, bro. Because I, I don't realize how much, how much time you took away from me. And you wasn't even... You wasn't even on it like I was. You wasn't even trying like I was. Imagine if you tried like I tried, my nigga. Imagine if... Imagine if I told you... You could do this, you could do that, like this, like that, like this, like that. And you still didn't do it. Fam, 
Why the fuck would I waste my time on you? Fuck you, nigga. Nigga, I done told you this shit a thousand times and you still ain't listening. That's what I don't like. Motherfuckers don't... Motherfuckers... Motherfuckers ego too high to listen, bro. Motherfuckers ego too high to, to realize that if everyone plays their part, then everyone wins. But motherfuckers don't see that. Because everyone has... everyone Everyone's ego too high. Everyone has trust issues. Everyone do this. Everyone do that. Everyone wants to move like this. Nobody wants to... Do it like me. And I can't force them. But you know what? Only I can do it like me, bro. Only I can do it like me. Y'all niggas can't do this shit like me. Y'all niggas can't rap like me. Y'all niggas can't come here like me and speak speak my mind freely. Y'all niggas can't do that. It's a lot of niggas that can't do that. That's no content creation is not for everyone, bro. Content creation is not for everyone, bro. Because everyone is a fucking follower. That's number one. Everyone's a follower. And you need social media to get big on social media. If you need social media to get big on social media, what did I say earlier? What did I say earlier? Every time you go on social media, it's a fucking trap. There's niggas, there's niggas that are not meant to escape the fucking trap. That's how life goes. There's niggas that are not meant to live today. That's how life goes. There's niggas that are not meant to do this shit. That's how life fucking goes, my nigga. It's not for everyone. I'm going to tell you straight up. I'm going to tell you straight up. If you ain't in it for the long, it's not for you. It ain't for you. And that's, that's, that's another reason why I don't really fuck with the internet. It's a lot of shit I don't like. That's another reason why I don't really fuck with the internet. Because motherfuckers who, it's motherfuckers who don't even try that go viral. It's motherfuckers that don't even do shit that go viral. You know what I'm saying? Off a meme or some dumb shit or some, and it's always the, it's always the, (laughs) Why it's always the fucking weirdos going viral. It's always weirdos going viral for for a charge or a case. It's always a motherfucker catching a case every fucking two weeks. It's never it's never something good. It's never nothing good. It's never a new it's never a new fucking underground rapper blowing up speaking his shit. Bro, it's never it's never nothing good. It's never nothing pr- promoting something good. I oh as as a kid, you know what I realized? I always looked at the news. My mom will always play the news. And every time the news will come on, it's always talking about a murder. It's always talking about some nigga robbed a bank or some shit. It's always talking about some nigga some there was a shooting last night at the gas station. It's always talking about some some deadly ass shit, bruh. It's always talking about some negative ass shit, bruh. I ain't trying to see that, bruh. I ain't trying to see that, bro. Because that shit going to lower me down, bro. That shit going to dig me. Bro, that shit going to... Bro, stay away from drama. Stay away from fucking drama. Because you going to be in a rabbit hole of... of you gonna, It's the only thing that's going to feed your attention. It's the only thing that will feed your attention. Stay away from that shit, bro. Because once you focus on that shit for too long, you going to crave it. And that's all you seek. And that's all you seek. You gonna crave that, bro. You gonna crave it so much to the point where now motherfuckers hate. Hating is a trend. Hating is now a trend. Hating is a trend. I can't believe this shit, bro. Everyone is a follower, my nigga. I can't believe this shit. Hating is a trend, my nigga. Why is hating a trend? Are y'all niggas stupid? Are y'all niggas stupid? That motherfuckers hating don't even be making the content. That motherfuckers hating don't even make be making the content. You hating on a nigga that's producing videos for you to fucking watch, for you for you to be entertained. For you to be entertained. You're hating on niggas that entertain you. You don't you don't entertain no one. You don't come here speak the truth. You don't do shit. 
You don't do shit. You're a bum. You're goofy. You're lame.